Hey, welcome back, ladies, to the 12 Weeks of Christmas series um, on the Expanded Folio album, which is this one. And uh, this is part five, I believe. So you're going to need pieces. Um, let's see, we need J and K. Okay, that's for, we need to finish the um, right side. So, we need pieces N and O. There's O. And N and M. So, M, N, and O, ladies. All right. So get your scoreboard out. Oops. All right. So piece uh, Okay, piece M is we're going to score on the eight and a half inch side at half an inch. So piece M. And I'm just going to go ahead and score mine at 8, which is half an inch. Okay. You can score at either side. It really doesn't, doesn't matter. Okay. So there's M. N, we're going to score on the 7 and a half inch side at half an inch on each end. So half an inch. On each end. Oops. Cut on my score line. <laughs> and on the nine inch side, we're going to score half an inch. This is going to form a pocket. And then piece O, scoring on the eight inch side at half an inch on each end. So on the eight inch side, half an inch on each side and again this is going to be forming a pocket okay and then on the five inch side at half an inch okay that is going to be forming our pockets okay so piece O let's apply our tape to the indented side apply your tape to the indented side And this is piece O that we're working on. Okay, it's going to be a pocket. Because we all know we like pockets. Okay, we're not going to tape in yet. But we will tape M. Let's see, M is... A second, I'm going to get my book out here real quick and familiarize myself self here just real quick okay there's our pocket there's our piece O there's our other pocket piece M must be this piece let me see yes it is okay that should be in the middle I don't know why I have that on the right side Oh, here's what I wanted to look at. This pocket here is open. And I think we want the R pocket to be open too. So, um, second, let me see. So, seven and a quarter. Well, we got, yeah, be seven and a quarter. We got seven and a half, so... <clears throat> let's okay I know what we'll do I know what we'll do we're going to reinforce that since we are we have that score line there 
and we'll just take advantage of that and we'll reinforce that pocket okay so on this one on your piece in okay this is going to be a little bit different ladies apply your score pile tape to the bottom of your pocket okay here's your pocket okay to the bottom of your pocket to the indented side all right now you're going to apply your tape to the left to the left side of your pocket okay just like that now you're going to miter this corner okay Go ahead and fold on your score lines, ladies. And make sure you put your tape on the left-hand side because otherwise your pocket's going to be opposite and you don't want your pocket being opposite. Okay? So we have our tape. Oh, my corners didn't. I need to miter my corner just a little bit better. They were touching. Don't want them touching. Okay, so now we are going to um, angle this pocket. I don't know if you remember seeing that right here. Just like I got folded out. <laughs> it's angled. Okay. So we want. three inches up and we want two inches over all right so three inches up I'm gonna get my pencil so three inches up now this is after you have a uh, um, folded this under okay Fold it under first, then go ahead and make your score, um, your little tick marks. And we're going two inches, so you're going three inches up and two inches over. All right, now I'm going to join and I'm going for my score line. Okay, we have this score line right here, I want to be right on my score line, my tick mark. So I'm going to show you something. We're going to do something here. We're going to reinforce this. Okay. So just like that, draw your line. <gasps> Cut her off. I should have used my um, scoreboard. I have a lot straighter line. Excuse me. Okay, now what we're going to do, we are going to add score pile tape to the inside. Okay, here's your pocket. We're adding the score pile tape to the inside, inside of this pocket, ladies. Now we're going to miter this corner and it's going to be a little bit different mitering, okay? I'm just going to barely miter this one's this side here and then I'm going to miter so I mitered like that because what we're doing, this is going to be folded over. For added, um, it will reinforce this side right here, okay? My pop, that ain't. Okay, so go ahead and take your little tape off that we just added. Bring that over. Give that a good burnish, and then... Ta-da! There's our pocket, ladies. 
that is our pocket and we reinforce this edge okay on this pocket um, I just want to make sure before I attach it that it's right and it is okay so now you're gonna miter the corners I didn't want it to be like the other other side. <laughs> oh. And you're gonna fold. Okay. Fold all three sides. And if your corners are touching, just um, rescore it or uh, remiter. It just, it just reduces bulk in this album. Almost got a little uh, nubbin or something sticking out there. I don't like that. Okay. There's a pocket. I'm going to give it another burnish. It's not wanting to sit very well. Okay, now it's going to go right on top of piece D. Okay. Right on top of piece D. I'm just going to line it up best that I can. And take my tape off. Alrighty, there's our pocket. Yay. Okay, now this pocket is going to go right here. And I'm just going to line it. Let's see. I got to line it up with my. Um, I was starting to line it up with my black is, and that's not correct. You want to line it up. Here's your half inch score line, ladies. Now, if you're using white cardstock here and um, you really don't want it to show, you can go ahead and put your paper down first. Okay? So you can put your paper down first and then put your pocket down. But the only bad thing about doing that is if you put your paper down first, then Whatever, when you put this down and then we put paper, paper um, takes hides this from when you're putting things in and out of your pocket. Here, let me see if I can find. Pretend this is design paper. So see, when it's down, paper's down, you don't have that to where, you know, stuff can get caught. That's why we always mat after we put the pocket down but I mean if you don't want that you know really showing you can go ahead and mat that first I mean it, and then you can you know you could always use a different color um, behind it if you wanted to make sure you don't go over your score line ladies here okay mine's a my pocket is crooked. For some reason. Let me check see where my score line's actually at. That walks away from my score line pretty good. I mean, not real bad, but it. It does just a little bit okay 
So line it up about an eighth of an inch away from your score line, ladies. Don't go into your score line. Stay away from your score, score line a little bit, okay? And then take your tape off. There's our other pocket, ladies. A nice, ample pocket. Okay. All right. So that's that over there so far. Now piece C. Okay, now I had you get out piece M. And we are going to fold towards the bumpy side, ladies. We're going to apply our tape to the outside half inch. I'm going to stay closer to the scored edge, ladies. See, is this going? Nope, this ain't going the full width, so I don't have to worry about tapering it. Okay, now I'm just going to center this, or try to. <clears throat> Sometimes it doesn't work out. Just line it right up. You want the same amount of space from top to bottom. And, and, okay. That's piece M. So now we can start working on um, the middle. And piece M really should be up there um, in the middle section, not on the right side. I don't know why I have that like that. Okay, so in the next video, we will need the rest of our pieces. You need K, two pieces of K. A uh, piece of L, J, two pieces of J, and a piece I, ladies. Alrighty. Well, we still got a little bit left. Let's go ahead and score these pieces. Okay. Okay, piece L. Um, six and a half at six so this is going to be a and I suppose I only cut one piece I did well we'll end it here ladies I'll go ahead and get my other L piece because you need two because it's um, a pocket so we'll go ahead and end it here and uh, I will see you guys in the next video you guys keep scrapping. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.